Hello everybody, this is Justin from KQS, and this is Castlevania Aria of Sorrow. So, um, every weekend I like to do something a little special, and uh, this is just gonna be, this isn't more so just me BSing around, I mean, it's generally what I'm playing on the weekend, and uh, this week I kinda wanted to get some more souls. Oh, fuck it. Probably get my ass kicked. Probably not so much, but... It'll be uh, a lot easier. It'll. I. I. Uh, I'm playing New Game Plus, so I have tons of cool weapons, and most of my souls. I just have to. I kind of want a hundred percent all the souls here, but that'll take some time. But um, hope you guys enjoy the collecting of souls. More majority of that. Um, I'm only gonna play for like maybe twenty minutes, but uh, this is probably. The Game Boy Advance ones are probably one of my favorite um, Castlevanias. And this one's really cool because you get to collect... Um, well, I don't want to give any, don't want to give any, any way, away any spoilers, but... You are basically... Um, uh, you basically have the power to uh, take the souls of uh, enemies you kill in this game. So, um, a lot of your old school buddies that you enjoyed... Um, like all the old school enemies that you love fighting, you can take some of their uh, abilities. And so, yeah, you play as Soma Cruz. And on your way to uh, like a festival or something. And yeah, this is actually a lot better because, like, Harmony of Distance is fun, but oh man, you get lost really fast and just. The music, the music really wasn't that good. Like I, I feel like they, I feel like they put too much memory towards the, the visuals and not enough towards uh, the actual, the music. And the music is what makes it great. And the art also here is just amazing. I love, I love the art style of the Castlevania games. Like ever since uh, Symphony of the Night. They've had this kind of art style, and then when they did the sequel to this game, the DS version, they basically went all out, all anime, and it was, it was fine, but it was just kind of funny. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm still slightly sick. And so, as with all Castlevanias, you take place in Dracula's castle. Oh, excuse me. My nose is just a little. So basically, I guess the Dracula's castle got sealed inside an eclipse, which is kind of funny, but it's kind of cool. Uh -huh. Oh no, an enemy! Gotta fight. Oh gosh. <laughs> Protect the girl! <laughs> oh my gosh, okay, this is gonna be easy if I got that. <laughs> Either that's predetermined or, oh god, that's gonna be easy. That is like um, one of the final swords of the game. Uh, the Calm Solis? I think that's what it's called. So, as you can see, you absorb uh, the abilities of the, mon of the monsters you kill. And so I can throw spears now, and plus I have a little bunch of other extra stuff. And so we gotta get to the very top, Dracula's quarters or whatever, to to beat the game. Uh huh. Well, I'll take care of her. I'll put up. Okay, protective barrier. Yep, you gotta go do it. Only you can save her. Genya Arikado. Which is actually kind of funny. I won't I won't tell any spoilers there. Yep. Hold on, let's check out my weapons. So, new game plus you're basic you're you're literally at one hundred. Or at uh your original original set 
So basically we've got all the cool stuff. I'm gonna use a handgun just for fun. Yes, yes, I know. I'm firing my gun, dude. So this game is actually... Um, this is the Metroidvania stuff. Let's see. Oh gosh. Hold on. Let me do something real quick. I need to literally reconfigure this. When I reset... I lost some stuff. So I, okay, I can't backdash yet. <laughs> Dang it! I want to backdash. Because when you backdash, you could actually gain an extra attack. I think I've sh I think I've slightly shown it with um. So yeah, grab the bat. I'm gonna find a better weapon. I like the handgun, and this is just way too overpowered. I have quite a bit of swords. I don't have every sword. There's a katana. I think I saw it. Easy yet sooner. Yeah, perfect. There we go. I think it's down. Yes, it is down here. Yeah, there we go. So you go sword. Hold on, I'm gonna just equip a different one. Nothing against the Yatsuna, but I kind of wanna. Lucifuna. Oh yeah, <laughs> that'll work. It basically follows all the original, original uh, Metroidvania stuff. Select is your menu. What I walked into was a, uh, what I walked into was a save room. I don't know how to, kind of want, I want to give myself a challenge, but I don't want to be overpowered. There we go. I like this one. Ow. Dang it. Okay, I have super armor, so I don't really need to worry so much. Yeah, let's fight that boss. He won't be too hard when I say that, but... Okay, that bone probably killed me. Yeah. Yeah, not too hard. They just do it. They just do a lot of damage. Like I'm still using like my super, my good armor. And it's still whooping my butt. Oh, I got 98% on that. Eh, just to be safe. Yeah, I'm only going to play for a little bit, but mostly I'm trying to just collect souls and look for walls. Uh, I maxed out on... Yeah, I, re I rarely use items in this game. Probably be way different for hard mode. So let's look at all my souls. But yeah, you can do tons of cool stuff. Um, can summon creatures. I don't have... Yeah, I didn't really get too many souls, but... Though when you do uh, restart, you, uh, all your... Most of your souls are... You keep most of them, but some of your souls that, like, progression souls, I guess you could say, are taken away. Uh, what do I want? That <laughs> Legion is always cool. Uh... So 
sorry, I'm just like looking through all this real quick. I wanna set fires in midair, slime balls. Cause yeah, they all they all take quite a bit of MP. Um Where's Flame Demon? Flame Demon's always good. And I I liked in the sequel. Um, the more souls you would collect, if you if you maxed out at nine, like it would be like leveling up. When you'd get one, you'd um, oh god, that would be easy. That would be good. Succubus is always good. I'm gonna go back and equip. I wish I had the silver gun. Silver gun is always good. Uh, sorry, I'm just like, looking through everything. Yeah. Love the baller sword made out of gold. And now, as you can see, a little plus five. Every attack that I make recovers 5% of my health. Or, uh, five hit points of my health. So it makes it extremely useful. Oh gosh, I thought I was gonna. Because yeah, if you uh, bat, if you bat, like, you can you can literally attack. You can attack three times. So one, hold on, one. Okay, this one you can't. Some of them like you have to like do. I can attack twice at least. If you cancel your animation into a back dash, you can do that. It's very helpful, especially with bosses and if you have a long reach weapon. Yeah, I have to get a special soul to do. Get up there. Dang it. Okay, I have to go down. Down and to the right. Progression souls. I'm glad that's strong. Oh yeah, here it is. And then, he can't swim yet, but he has like a... Oh, you get a special soul that lets you do that. And this is the soul we need. Flying armor. Where is flying armor? And now, it just like lets me float. Whee! And you just hold it. A nice thing, I like the Game Boy ones because they really optimize stuff. Because you just have to hold the R button and the L button, which is pretty natural when it comes to fighting these dudes. Uh, I'll get to, the, to another boss. And then I'll uh, call it quits. But I do, I, I'm basically, during the Super Bowl, I'm going to be playing this. <laughs> Screw football. <laughs> Oh gosh. Thank you, good armor. I think only the bosses like will wreck will literally wreck my shit. And see now you hold the R button and we just we glide across. Boom. Oh he's tough. Oh gosh, he is tougher. Yeah, those white skeleton dudes are ugh, they can be a pain. They throw grenades. Rotten meat. I'm trying to think what soul. There's a special soul that lets you eat. Because if you eat rotten meat, you'll just you'll die. You'll lose health. But there's like a special soul that lets you eat that stuff. Yeah, these ones you have to kind of time very carefully with the downward action. Yep, thank you. <coughs> Sorry. Ugh. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty much over my sickness, but I'm not like... Ugh, I, I have just like a stuffy nose and just like crap. Ugh. That kind of crap. Okay, for a second I thought it was like a broken wall. I don't know what I was thinking. 
Whee. See, backdashes are nice. We jump over you. Jeez. Yeah, this thing is way too powerful. And that, you need other special abilities. Yeah, they literally do have like little like progression. They do have progression walls. Like that, I'd probably. Uh, there's like special souls to fly. Jeez. I just wreck people. <laughs> and that, you need a. Uh... I think there's a boss here. I think there is, because that's the only. That's the only way down. We'll check. Money! And yeah, the less you use your magic, the more the more money you'll get from dudes. Okay, I thought they were gonna attack me there. Whee! I don't know if a boss is here. I, I I I um I beat this a few like a couple months ago, so probably like in October. And don't mind my dog. She likes to bark. Uh no. Sorry, we'll get to the next boss and then I'll, I'll stop from here. You know, I'm gonna switch weapons more. Cause there's tons the cool thing about him is there's tons of weapons to work with. We'll use the hammer. Yeah. Oh. Hammers are good, but the only the only place where it hits is right at the top. So you need it, it's not really a weapon for uh, hitting for dude like multiple dudes, but it does hit overhead, which is good when you're under people. So I think. Hold on. Let's see if I get really close, if I can hit them. That wasn't there. Ugh. This is the fun of Castlevania. It's just, it's all about exploration. And you do get some cool stuff. So, I can do the old school. That's pretty much the Dracula flame attack. That takes ton of, tons of your magic. Yo, dude. <laughs> Should just close the door on him. I'm just kidding. Like, we just transported. Yep, we're in Dracula's castle, alright. The true castle of oh, oh, oh. I, I, I watched Twilight before. I haven't. <laughs> Just fuck that. No. I, I, I kind of want to see that new Dracula movie that they came out with. Like, when I see that, it reminds me of this. You know, Dracula, Dracula gets resurrected every hundred years, and there's always a Belmont to kill him. Or there usually is. Yeah, 1999, Dracula dies. Nope. <laughs> that would suck. I would, I feel, I'd feel sorry for Dracula. Like, he just wakes up. Oh no, I'm gonna die. So they, they sealed him into this, this eclipse that happens every so often. Which is the same thing as like the whole hundred year stuff, so it doesn't do doesn't do much. Yep. Oh no, he's gonna inherit all the powers. Later, dude. Yeah. 
eh, that guy's a, an okay guy. That was mostly about, um, oh yeah, we, we can get to this boss real fast. This won't take very long at all. See the, see watch, I can't hit anything. Gosh. Hold on, let's see. Cause look, I can barely, like it has to be at the end of that swing. Can't be up top. So each, the nice thing about this is you, you, you use tons of weapons and they each have different properties, which I like, which I think is good. Yeah, we need to go down. Terminator Skull. <laughs> That's what it reminds me of. Oh, gosh. Ah, shoot. Okay. Yeah, we're just gonna get to the boss. I, I would explore more. Dang. The hammer is tough to use. Well, not really. It's not that. It's not that difficult. But man, just like, just the the properties of where it hits can get a little can be a bit difficult. Dang it. There we go. The good thing about the hammer, though, is it hits hits on the ground. Just boom. You just have to kind of... And this is the nice thing of having the succubus soul. Is like, you, you can just hit projectiles and you'll just be perfectly fine. Oh, wait. Yay! This is nice. Um, let's mess around with extra stuff. Tridents. Cause yeah, you get tons of cool stuff. I wish I had the silver gun. The silver gun is super like silver gun I think has like 70 attack power. Oh man, it's that one's a good gun to use. Um trying to think of something. Jeez, that would be too crazy. Um Man, that spear would just demolish that dude. Hold on, I'm trying to find a good weapon to use. That's not like particularly overpowered. Um we we'll use the partisan. And that is a stabbing weapon. Let's see, I can do the dash cancel. If, if I if I completely screw, oh okay, this guy's not too hard. Hey, buddy. Yeah. Ooh, <laughs> that was. Yeah, the good thing is they have really good tells. Oh gosh! Oh gosh! Uh, oh gosh, that that hurts. But yeah, I just wanted to show different weapons, souls. Is that like, oh, I, I could show more if I my my help my when you well, when you start out everything, you're pretty damn weak. Especially when like a lot of the stuff you use, um, a lot of the souls require much more MP than. Than anything. Because, yeah, like. What, how much do I have? Oh, yeah, I only have 100. So I can only use two magic attacks, generally. Good ones. Okay. I think I'm going to let you guys go from here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I'm probably going to be playing this during the Super Bowl. I'm, I'm going to be bored as hell. <laughs> But I uh, hope you guys enjoy. Um, don't forget to uh, thumbs up and subscribe for more reviews, randomness, and videos like this. Again, this is Justin from KQS, and until we meet again, comrades.